Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a good day. So today we're painting another Tinkerer, and this is Jebediah, who's primed in desert yellow, just like his counterpart Haley was, uh, because it would make the wood look amazing uh, on his wheelchair. And we're starting off with some malignant green speed paint. Uh, this is going to be for his, uh, what do you call that, the work apron, an apron. Yeah, yeah, that's a blacksmith's apron. Uh, so it doesn't show much on here right now, but it will later on when you have future colors. Hardened leather now, we're going to be doing this on the entire uh wheelchair and that desert yellow actually acts as a great backdrop for this speed paint so if you're using speed paints and you're not you don't have the white or you don't have any other lighter colors the desert yellow actually does a pretty good job now i haven't tested too much with other colors i just found with the brown and the wood color it kind of gave it that nice depth and that nice uh old wooden you know it's been used this thing he's you know he's not a young guy this tinkerer and uh, so it comes out looking really nice next we're gonna be using some dark wood speed paint and this is gonna be for some little parts here and there including his cap uh, his gloves um, and uh, I think what else are we using this on? I can't remember exactly. Oh yeah, the uh, that it looks like a bedroll uh, that he has at the front of his wheelchair there. I'm not sure. It looks like it. I mean, it could be just like a, a mat of some sort. And you get these little tassels here uh, that are what tie up his uh, apron and stuff like that. So you just want to get all these areas. And again, with that desert yellow in the, in the background kind of thing, uh, these speed paints do a pretty good job on that one. Next, we're moving on to some evil chrome. Uh, we're gonna be doing this like for the pistons, I guess, and whatever is underneath holding up this whole wheelchair, uh, and also the big. Uh, I guess these are like the. I guess this is what sets out the steam, or these pots, or I don't know what these are. I think that, I think he's got a mechanical wheelchair here, from what I can see. Uh, so I'm assuming this is like a steam powered thing, and that's where the steam comes out, kind of like his mufflers. Um, yeah, and I figured this evil chrome was perfect for that. Gun metal now for some of the shiny bits. So just some of the little parts here on the wheels. We're also going to be using that on his huge wrench of his. Uh, sorry, I went off camera there. I don't know what happened. Uh, you know, it happens. You're concentrating on your miniature more than on your video. And your miniature just gets lost in the process. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, so don't forget his big wrench. And he has these two little, like guns i guess i think they are oh and his little monocle too as well you don't want to forget that uh yeah so those two little guns i think poking out at the front of his um wheelchair this is very reminiscent of uh wild wild west if you haven't seen that uh, the one that uh, i don't remember his name the actor i can't think of it right now but anyways he's got like this wheelchair with all sorts of crazy contraptions in it opal skin now for his face this is from the skin tones uh paint set and then ash gray for his beard because he had an ash colored um, beard and I find uh, if you also keep this uh, water down a bit it'll not you know be super thick on there it'll be nice in coverage uh, next we're using some armor gray this is a zombie side invader paint and this is a unique paint color uh, it's almost white but it does have a touch of a hint like a nice little highlight of gray very 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 um, what do you call that oh geez uh just, you know not noticeable that much like it's just it's, it's just there but it does a perfect job on his shirt and it's actually surprising but i don't use any kind of uh wash on any of this paint after a little bit of wet mud now just to use some effects from the army painter putting this on his wheels like as if it's splattered up some mud because later on i will put some uh, wet texture or some muddy ground texture is called i think from vallejo uh and then some dry rust just on some of the parts of uh his wheelchair there like the bolts and stuff so a bit on there just to make it look like this thing has been around crusader skin now to finish off the face and there you have it jebediah is painted ready for the table i want to thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed these videos hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel hit that like button and we'll see you all in the next one